remember that it is already a battleground remember that krishn himself has tried the utmost to avert war he himself had gone as a messenger to the court of duryodhan and tried his best now all that is behind before war the right action is please try to prevent war war means a lot of suffering on the battlefield now you cannot act like a peacenik now you have to be an eagle not a dove now you must fight sir if you said that uh, very few among us would say that i don't know but the fact of uh, uh, even trying is much appreciated sometimes yes why is it the fact of uh, even trying ha huh. Uh, if we don't know then if we are trying then it is much appreciated right good you are right that trying is wonderful but even in trying there are two types two very very distinct types what's your name one is i want to go to jaipur <coughs> and i'm just trying to know the road that goes to jaipur so i'm asking four people five people about it how to go to jaipur how to go to jaipur will this highway take me there do i have to take this kind of turn that kind of turn and all those things that's one kind of effort trying means effort right that's one kind of effort now what am i trying to know i have already decided that i'll go to jaipur what am i trying to know all that i'm trying to know is the route and where do i get the next gas station where is the next mcdonalds is the road all right that kind of stuff now is this information that i'm trying to gather important at all when i have already decided that jaipur is my destination everything else is insignificant is it or is it not yes i have already decided that i need to murder somebody now all that i am trying to determine now is the means of murder should i use a long knife should i use an axe should i use an ak47 should i drop a nuclear bomb now is this question important at all the motive of murder has already been decided the rest of the effort is just to substantiate the motive are you getting it now this effort is what 99% of us engage in we have already deeply frozen our concepts of life and our effort is just to achieve the goals that we have already frozen for ourselves this effort is of very little worth because this is not an effort to know the truth this is just an effort to achieve what you have already opinionated to be important my opinions must remain secure there is another kind of effort and that is a far more challenging effort only the really courageous ones make that effort that effort says i am all right even if the last one each single one of my beliefs is devastated and that hurts that really hurts at least in the beginning it hurts i'm all right see ego thrives on beliefs ego thrives on opinions and it requires tremendous energy to let your core beliefs be challenged to put your core assumptions to scrutiny assumptions about relationships 
assumptions about life itself. Is this the way life ought to be lived? This is what I call real effort. And this is obviously praiseworthy. This kind of effort, Varun, is praiseworthy. But that first kind of effort in which you already know what you want to do and you are just struggling to reach there. You look at the common man on the street. You look at the kind of effort he actually makes. And the poor fellow is actually struggling day in and day out. I was coming to your place. It took me more than 2 hours 20 minutes to reach here from Noida. Look at, I mean, I've already told myself that I must have a good corporate, respectable, traditional job. And that's what I'm doing. Every day I take two hours, one way to commute. Every day I take two hours to come back. This is soul sapping effort. This is soul sapping effort of no use, of no avail. But we'll keep on doing it because that's our notion. That's what I did for my BTEC for. That's what I did my MBA for. To have that kind of a job. And now I have bought this car on EMI. And I feel so good. That I'm going to my office driving my car. My own car. Which by the way is owned by the bank. And it's a lot of effort. Actually a lot of effort. And if I return at around 8. I'll see the same scene again. It is a lot of effort. Believe me. But this effort. Is wasteful effort. Of no use at all. You are struggling for nothing. For nothing. You are struggling just to maintain your assumptions. Just so that the world can. Be agreeable to you. Just so that your parents can feel proud of you. Just so that you can have a good wife or husband. And good within quotes. Good according to your opinion. Which obviously is not your opinion but the society's opinion that you have assimilated. Why struggle so much? What is the point of this trying? We actually spend a lot of energy. We do. But where does all that energy go? What's the point of all that energy? I had people from my batch. Toppers. And toppers in a department in IIT who dedicated all the energy of their life to topping. Now the fellow is burning the midnight oil, losing weight every night, in cramming a subject that he has no affinity for. Alright, he gets a CGP of 9.2, 9.5 and then he goes on to do his MBA. I mean, the dude could have lived, right? The CGPA instead of being 9.5 could have been 8.5. And he could have saved a lot of time and energy to really live. 
But he spent four years doing this and then after doing his B.Tech, the fellow did his MBA. What's the point? All that energy was spent just because you are a good boy who has been the class topper, the board topper. So now you must be the department topper in IIT as well. When he was in class 5, his mother had told him, you must always be the topper. So the fellow is spending all his energy in being the topper. But why? What's the point? Chill, relax, sleep. Wouldn't that be far better? And the result of this is that when we are faced with occasions that really require energy, we find ourselves short of energy. Then we can't do anything. Because a lot of our effort, our energy is being dissipated in meaningless tasks just to please everybody around. <clears throat> just to please everybody around, you are in spending so many hours, so many kilojoules. And what are you left with? So, let us be all for effort, but let that effort come out of our individuality. We must know what is worth striving for, right? Effort is wonderful, but we must first know where to put our energy or is energy so cheap that you'll keep wasting it. It's your energy, mind it. It's your life. Is it so cheap that you'll keep wasting it? Yeah? Yes. All right.